apartment. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name's Ella and today I'm going to show you guys an apartment tour but super spooky and fun and festive. So everything that I'm showing I will try and link down below. If I can find any I'll also try and link dupes. So here we have our giant photo wall. For Halloween this year we mostly just care about the pictures per usual. So me and my roommates are going to be doing like a photo shoot like the week before so we have like cute pics to post. So here on this wall, this is the first wall when you walk in, it's just a black mesh um, thing that people usually put over doors or even as tablecloths and we expanded it, put it all across the wall, we added fairy lights, um, this is all spider webbing but it sticks to the mesh perfectly. Um, we added this little spider guy, all these little ghosts. Um, most of these are actually from my roommate Bailey who is helping me film today, 10 out of 10. I'll link her Instagram down below if you want to follow her. And most of the stuff is actually from her house. Her parents are in the process of moving and they donated all this to us. So thank you so much, Bailey's family. So we have all of this. The purple lights are so cute and so pretty. And then we also have some skeletons up there. Just very good, spooky vibes. Here we have our bar cart, all of my roommates, oh, there's Wiggles! <laughs> all of my roommates are 21, if you didn't know. I'm going to be 21 soon. I do not condone underage drinking, drink responsibly this Halloween. But, and then down here we have our little animal graveyard, just full of little skeletons of little animals. And we put these little burlap things that used to be across our walls down there to make it look like dirt. And then, um, on the bar cart, we just hung up a little ghost, and then we also have glow lights on the inside of it to kind of make it a little more pizzazz and fun, and it looks really good at night when all the lights are lit up. And then on the mirror up here, we have the just some extra spider webbing because we didn't really know what to do with that. So now, moving on to this part of the living room. Um, our living room theme was blue, but um, obviously due to Halloween, we've added a lot of black and then also like some more sparkly items. So here on the coffee table, um, we have, it's very similar to the mesh on the back wall. It's um, just like spider webbed mesh. And then we have some glitter pumpkins, skull. This giant candle is from Target and it was only about $15, great deal. Then um, we have some spiders, some little eggs, and then we also have a strand of fairy lights running through it. These look great again at night, all lit up. And then on the TV, very similar vibe to the coffee table. We have glow lights, but these ones are jack o' lanterns. Then we have some little cauldron candles that we probably won't light unless it's Halloween, they're more for decorative purposes. Some glitter pumpkins, this cute little sign. One day we all painted pumpkins. So we also have all of our painted pumpkins. And then down below we just have some extra fall decor that we didn't know what to do with. That was a little too fall, not enough Halloween, so we just added it down there. Then up here on our home sign we have spider webbing, more pumpkin lights or lantern lights. Then we also added these little bats because they looked cute hung up and we didn't know where to hang them, but they actually stuck perfectly to the home sign. And then in this corner, this is my ex-man's. Um, no, we haven't named him yet, but if you guys want a name for him, comment it down below, we would love to know. Um, it's this little ghost guy, and then we put up spider webbing all around. Um, just kind of make it look like he's floating. Um, we decided the other day that he kind of looks like the Dementors from Harry Potter. So if you guys agree, let us know. And then on this table, we have another bat, a fish, and then some extra Halloween decor. And then across our windows, we have um, these, it's like thrills and chills sign, um, a little skeleton behind it, and then we have extra spider webbing. We wanted to add more in the window so people could see and um, just kind of add a little something extra. And then throughout the whole entire apartment, we have these, um, they're originally Christmas lights, but they actually look really good at night. And we just had my friend Mick, shout out to Mick, for stringing all of these across our apartment for us. Now, so here we actually have a homemade um, cauldron. So inside is actually a diffuser and then we covered it with fluff and with some little eyeballs and it works perfectly and it looks so cute. Um, just make sure that you are home when this is on because we are afraid this could be a fire hazard, undetermined. But we did put lavender essential oils in it so we can see from it smell great. And then over here we have um, this really cute skull punch. 
um, container and then we have these little glass jars that go with it that'll be super cute to put um, like punch in or drinks or even like I've seen people on Pinterest do it's like the strawberry and lemonade water in here and it looks so good um, it just is super cute super fun and we got this from Walmart funny story I thought it was $1.99 it's actually $19.99 but I still had to get it it was so cute um, most of our kitchen isn't super Halloween decorated because we use the kitchen every single day and it would just be a lot to have to move around decorations. So, but we also have these super cute little Halloween dish towels and it just kind of helps spice up the living room and kitchen but not making it an inconvenience for us to get in and out. And then we also put over more mesh webbing that you guys have seen on the other walls over the kitchen shine just to add a little something extra um, especially because when you walk in it's so Halloween in the living room but not enough back here so we added some more here then this is our little um, plant station and we added some little skeleton guys and then there's my roommate's plants and this cute vintage telephone and then we also have this from my roommate Bailey's house. It is so cool. It lights up at night and it's really fun. It just is like little signage and the little light lights up and it looks so good at night when it's really dark in here. And this will be super cute um, just to have it, especially because their rooms are upstairs and then here's the downstairs. It's cute that it's like different signage for places. So super cute, super fun. And then now we're gonna head outside to the patio. Okay, now we're outside on our patio. We live next to a highway, so I'm gonna be screaming at you guys. I'm so sorry. But here we just have the um, more of those lights that you guys have seen up um, in the living room across the ceiling. We have them strung up through the entire patio. And then this is one of our other mans. This is Mr. Bones. Um, we love him. But we did zip tie him down so people can't steal him. And then um, he just sits out here and then the, we mostly just did lights. The lights make it look super great at night, super cute, super festive. And we mostly just left the outside area pretty bare until Halloween just because we don't want, one, anything to be stolen. And we also don't want to have to worry about it with the elements. We live in Texas, so it is hot all the time. It's either like 100 degrees or it's pouring, pouring rain. So we didn't want to have to deal with the elements. So we chose just to keep it very minimal out here. And then when you're heading back inside, we have one of these cute little haunted signs up. But other than that, that's pretty much um, what we have outside. So now we can head back inside. So that is my Halloween apartment tour. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are brand new to my channel or if you haven't subscribed, make sure and subscribe down below. It would mean the world to me and join our little family here. I upload twice a week and I hope you guys are having a great afternoon, morning, or night. Bye everyone.